Huh. Well, I have to admit, friends, this is definitely one of the songs we have given him that makes me wish we could caterwaul along because it did not sound the best to my ears. Oh, but we definitely can see how many of the music sheets we have given him because he hangs them up after we're done. Excellent! All right, my wonderfully musically talented friend, I have another one. The way you compute tonight. Oh, and another one's been added. We're just missing two more of the music sheets to give to him. That is so fantastic. But hello, everyone, and welcome. Welcome back to Stray, where we are following our poor stray cat, Bucket, as he continues to try to escape from the city and has now gone along and befriended several of the robots, including B12, our constant companion, as we uh, have gone on this little adventure. And now we actually need to go ahead. I, I want to try to get to grandma's place by going up this time so that I can keep an eye out for the last two music sheets we're missing. And if we can find two more energy drinks, then we'll also, oh, come on. We almost, yeah, 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 yeah. you can do it, you can do it. Come on, Bucket, good job. But I want to find the last two energy drinks so that we can go ahead and get whatever the last thing Barterman has so that all know that we have properly and thoroughly explored everywhere that the slums had to offer before it's going to be time to go ahead. We haven't been over there yet. Whoops. I'm sure that's fine. But I want to know we have explored everywhere that the slums had to explore before we head off and see what's happening in the upper parts of the city, which, can you see them from over here? Oh yeah, you can if you look straight up. Man, that would be so hard. I wonder why anyone didn't try just building like a ladder or something, but I bet the other parts of the robot city probably get really violent at trying to like make sure they don't have anybody sneaking in and creating spots where the Zerk could possibly get through. All right, so this is, don't think is gonna help me the way I wanted. But let's explore over here. Interesting, interesting. Down here. Up we go. Did I already raid this one? I did. I wanna be able to get over to the other side because I just feel super sus that there might be something useful over there. That's way more satisfying than it probably should be. Is that down by Grandma's place? <laughs> okay. Oh, there's somebody here! I knew somebody would be nearby. Hello? Hector! Oh, hey, it's you. You do look weird and small, but there's something about you. I feel compelled to pet you, uh, but I won't because I don't understand why. Uh... So those are some high-quality cables. Grandma use this, uses this to craft her unique clothes. Thank you, Hector. Hmm. So he was just, like, hanging out and watching me. I wonder... I wonder what we might need to do with Hector at some point. Hmm. Just some more burned clothes in the slums. It just makes me so curious, like, if people are just forgetting something. Because I always wonder how a slum becomes a slum. Like, does someone just, like, hang up some laundry and, like, walk away and never remember? Alright, let's come down here. Rip humans. Wait, rip humans? I could have sworn we had that memory. But maybe not. Okay, that's kind of ominous, actually. Let's go down and look. Hello? That's fine. That's just creepy. Rip humans. Humans were the first residents around here. It seems that they're all dead now. What do you think it feels like being dead? I know it's silly coming from me, but are they actually at peace? Will I be at peace when I die? I don't know what death feels like for an AI. I'm sorry. I didn't want to break the mood. Let's move on. The mood? I don't think you can break a mood. That is literally just like, rip humans, my friend B12. That being said, though, I think we did find another one of these digicans. Alright, so I need one more in order to get whatever the mystery thing is. I don't want to go down there. 
It's scary. That's the way to the Zerks. I'd prefer not to. Alright, let's see if I can find my way to Grandma from here. <gasps> Um. Um. Oh. Okay. Deep breaths. Okay. All right. Okay, that's not that's not that's not. That's that's just not. Oh, wow. There's like ripped out cables all around. Okay, cat. Cat is curious. Cat is curious. Cat studies from all angles. That's not cool. That's not cool. Excuse me, Seamus? You gotta fix that. Seamus? I feel we have bigger problems. Okay, I think it's just. An illusion? A, 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 a glitch? Wow. That scared me more than anything else we've run across. More than the Zerk, to be honest. Because you just have... Are you kidding? Okay, yeah, that's not okay. That's really, really, really not okay. It just does not feel pleasant to be staring in... Yeah. Okay. Alright. That's fine. It's not fine, to be honest. Not fine at all. If it moves, I think I'm gonna scream. All right, grandma, grandma. Just gonna innocently, charmingly, happily find my way to grandma now. All right, grandma's clothes. <sighs> Deep breaths. Whew, okay, all right, yeah, no, 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 no. Grandma? Hello, little one. Do you have any of the electric cable for me? Sure do. Thank you, my dear. I'll get to work right away. Oh, that's precious. That's really precious. I am so glad we had Grandma to hang out with. There you go, little one. It'll suit you well. So do you like your new outfit? Some of my finest handiwork. Thank you, Grandma. I needed the recovery from the terror that we just experienced. Boy, that that was scary. All right, let's see. Uh, Elliot, Elliot. Elliot? I'm trying to remember, because Elliot's nearby, right? Hmm. I think he was over here. It's actually not like a super big, was he over here? I don't like the dark alleys all by myself again. Cause it was all just a little too much. No, this is Elliot right here. Okay, so let's knock. I would like back in, please. Thank you, friend. And then let's take this up to Elliot. Cause his coolant is running over time, apparently. Elliot? Don't worry, the tracker is safe here with me. But I can't work unless I have a cloth to keep me warm. Oh, where did you find this? It's amazing. Let me try it on. Look, no, uh, look, no tremors. I'm able to do work again. Thanks. Now I can definitely fix your tracker. Let me take a look. Just gotta give it an update and one more thing. Voila. Yay, fixed tracker. There you go, little one. Good luck finding who you were looking for. Thank you, Elliot. Thanks again for the poncho. Come back any time. By the way, do I look pale to you? You know, I don't want to be... I don't want to be too dark. But I can't help but wonder just how long do their systems continue to function? He's very chill for me just jumping all over his stuff, which I appreciate. But I, I do wonder, like, how long do their systems continue to work? All right, anything else in here? Like a convenient energy drink? Is that why he had those tremors? Hmm, hello? Or is this, nah, it's just another place to sharpen my claws. There's something about being in the slums, like, do people just become so tired you don't clean? Probably, and I'm not trying to judge. I just, <sighs> 
for me in my life, I think I, I bring a lot of mental peace and order to myself by trying to keep it as clean as possible. Because I did not grow up with people who like to keep things clean. Hello? I know you, right, Zoe? That guy is cleaning the paint again. Sure is making use of all the detergent. Yep. Okay, I think it's very clear where our next steps. That's still not okay. I still don't like that. Seamus! Seamus, fix it! Did you manage to fix the tracker? Yes, Seamus. You did? You fixed it? Well done! Give it here! So now you can track your dad, huh? Oh, I don't think this is gonna end well for him, though. I wonder if he'd risk his life to try to figure it out. We've got a ping! Is Papa really alive? I can't believe it! Let's follow the tracker! Maybe we'll find where my Papa went. Oh boy. Alright, so now we've got to follow Seamus. That's still not okay! Ah! And then there's just like hands and arms sticking out of here. It does make me want to just clean everything and put plants down. All right, where are we going, Seamus? I have a feeling he might be heading towards the sewers, right? Maybe? More corruption on the image about the plants. Oh, oh, the door that only the guardians can open. We're gonna have to ask him to open it and then rush the zerks. All right, well, I wish I could find that last piece, but we gotta do what we gotta do. This must be it. He really left the slums. It's dangerous out there, but I, I must be sure. I need to know. Let's do this. Isn't this the door? Uh, Seamus, I don't think this is a good idea. Isn't this the door? Seamus. Lock it. Lock it. Lock it right now. Oh. Oh. Oh, man. Seamus, lock this door. Lock it behind me. But how am I gonna get find it without the tracker? Seamus! You fool! Oh, thank goodness he closed it. He's gonna die. He's gonna die and he's gonna, like, save us at the last moment. Because he's trying to figure out what happened to his papa. Look at all these zerk eggs. They'll eat us. I can't do this. I'm not as fast as you. The zerks will get me for sure. Here, take this badge. My papa will recognize it. He'll know you're a friend. I'll open the door for you. Ah? Ah? Do I get a minute to... Oh, man. Okay, hang on. I want a minute to look around. That I hope won't kill us. But I feel obligated to make sure I'm not missing, like, any little memory spot. That's terrible. How do you destroy the Zerk eggs? Well, actually, I guess this is... Oh, deep breaths. This is actually a vitally, fundamentally important part of understanding that mission. Because his dad, Doc, was working on a way to get rid of the Zerks. Alright, Seamus. I'm sorry, I can't go any further. I'm not as fast. The Zerks will get me. Please find him. Please bring my father back. Okay. We're gonna start running and I'm just not gonna stop. I have no idea where I'm going. Dead end. Oh, well that's, yep. That just lets me know how things are gonna go. Uh, oh, memory. Oh, thank goodness I looked around first. So what do we find? Look how huge this wall is. I remember, it was a symbol of the division between those in the slums and in Midtown. That and the fact that they kept throwing their garbage down here. What a horrible thing to do. Maybe that's why they failed. Okay. I think that's all we're gonna get from over there, because everything else is surrounded by barbed wire literally everywhere. And there's Zerk. Okay. So... Yeah, there's Zerk down there, there's Zerk over there. The walls are too slick to run on. 
and I think we're just going to need to make a blistering run for it. <sighs> yep. Let's get a move on. And up we go. And down we go. And over we go. And around we go. And zig and zag. And zig and zag. Okay. Being a cat, being a cat, being a cat, being a cat, being a cat. Okay, zigzag, 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 jump, 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 jump. Okay. Jump, 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 jump. Jump, 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 jump. Thank you, thank you. Uh-huh. Alright, alright. Oh man. Please okay, gotta come down here, got it. Okay. At least they're not like hyper intelligent. Up we go, up we go, up we go. Please. Okay. Down we go. Over we go. Oh come on. Cross. How am I gonna okay. Got it, got it. Let's swing you there. Just enough weight, maybe? Please? Oh, okay, let's try again. And then, there we go. Enough weight we can get across. Okay, so, deep breaths, friends. Here we go. Oh my gosh. Easy goes! Easy does it! Easy does it! Oh boy! Was not- ah? Was not expecting that! <laughs> Are you okay? That was a huge fall! Doc should be nearby. We must be close. Is that a frog? <gasps> no, we're still in the slums. I thought maybe- Are those frogs? Other life? Oh, and we're really hurt. We gotta clean our little feetsies. Maybe those aren't frogs. Maybe those are actually just the chirps of, like, baby zerks. <laughs> but alright guys, thank you so much for joining me on this extremely dangerous mission that at least we have more plants for now. If you guys could, do please leave a like for our little cat bucket. And if you'd like to join us on this and literally thousands more adventures, do please consider subscribing, but most importantly, my friends, stay curious, and I'll see you guys next time. Bye-bye!